The purge bulb, more commonly called the primer bulb, manually pumps fuel into the carburetor, which purges the air out of the carburetor. Without a functioning purge bulb, you must pull the starter rope multiple times until the carburetor diaphragm can pump enough fuel into the carburetor for the engine to start. Over time, the purge bulb will harden and crack due to its constant exposure with fuel. Once cracked, it will no longer pump fuel into the carb, causing a hard starting engine. Replacing the purge bulb is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. Hi, I'm Mark Soja. Do-it-yourself repairs like these are easier than you might think. From lawn machines to cordless drills, kitchen mixers, outdoor grills, our how-to videos walk you through each repair from start to finish. So doing it yourself means never having to do it alone. Let's get started. I'll begin by removing the air filter cover from the top of the saw. Next, I'll engage the brake and remove the top cover. The top cover is secured with three screws. Next, I'll remove the air filter. Now remove the fuel lines from the back of the purge bulb. I want to take note of where each line goes before I remove them. Now I'll remove the old purge bulb. You'll notice that the purge bulb attaches with a couple of plastic clips. I'll use a screwdriver to push up on one of the clips as I pull it away from the housing. Now I can install the new primer bulb. You'll notice that there's a small tab on one side of the primer bulb, and that aligns with this cutout in the housing. Once it's aligned, I just snap it into place. Now I'll reinstall the fuel lines. I'll reinstall the air filter. I'll reinstall the top cover. The spark plug wire fits into a grommet on one side of the cover. Let's make sure that gets reinstalled. I'll secure the cover with the screws. And I'll finish up by reinstalling the air filter cover. And that's all it takes to install a new purge bulb in your outdoor power equipment. Be sure to check back often for new videos and expert advice. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and leave a comment.